of African people. If you are united, colonialists will never survive in this beautiful continent. It is them who said somewhere and decided to divide Africa. And they divided Africa not because they loved the beauty of Africa. They never loved our mountains. They never loved our trees. They never loved our beautiful beach. They never loved the people of Africa. They divided us because of the resources of Africa. That's why before colonialism, it was business companies that came here before. It is those companies that discovered the beauty of Africa in terms of resources. Hello my fellow Afghan, this is Life Update to make Africa great. I would like to welcome you and thanks you for watching our video. So my fellow Afghan, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, please subscribe now for more video. So my fellow Afghans, let us look why America is sending troops to the DLC Congo for expected protest. So many things are happening in Africa, but let us look on, on this site why america sending troops to the drc congo for expected protests and not to burning flames so the united states of america has deployed troops to gabon in anticipation of violent protest in the democratic republic of congo flames in the other end already has violent protests but no similar action has been taken you can ask yourself why this happened into africa so trump once said we more and more are not wanting to be the policemen of the world we are spending tremendous amount of money for the case policing the world and that shouldn't be the priority in the letter to congress trump said eight military personnel and the appropriate combat equipment has been deployed to gabon to support the security of united states a uh, citizen personal and the diplomatic diplomatic facilities in Kinshasa you remember this Kinshasa is the capital city of uh, Congo DRC or former called Zaire so more troops will be deployed in the region if necessary Trump say they will remain in the region until the security situation in the Democratic Republic of Congo becomes such that their, pro their presence is no longer needed the letter also say the move was taken to protest uh, to protect the United States citizen both at home and abroad and in, in, in furtherance of the United States national security and the foreign policy interests. What are American foreign uh, policy interests in the Democratic Republic of Congo? An even bigger question is doesn't America have interest in doesn't America have interest in France? And if it, it does, just how many soldiers have been deployed to France? The world deserves to know if this is just America's standard procedure or it is the plan made especially for an African country. In France, in France mere tweet ain't Trump a stain warning, leave our nation be. If tweets were such disrespect dis 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 to a national sovereignty, why should the army deployed to to be tolerated to be tolerated? The doubt and the double standard the doubt and double standard in foreign relationship with African country are palpable. The anticipation of violence in in Africa country troop deployment, yet burning fence is untouchable even in social media. The, there is, however, possibility that the issue is not even political but economical. After all, the business standard recently ran an a headline: "Mining world keep, keep well, mining world keeps keen keen eye as Congo counts vote for next leader." The true American invasion are above under Congolese soil, with an an untapped minor worth of over US, US dollar, uh, 24 trillion, the, the DRC will always attract unwanted attention. This is not, however, to say there is no problem 
in the country because tension are indeed lazing it is just the intention of the friendly americans that ought to be tested so my fellow Africans, let us pray for our, our brothers and sisters mothers and fathers our children in congo that is the situation people are preparing and uh, the soldiers are to invite the congo that is the reality because congo is the richest uh, country with a lot of resources and natural resources so everyone is looking for congo that's why you see america is interested with congo also there is a conflict in gabon but you didn't see or you didn't hear or heard that america is sending troops in gabon to help the, pe the, the, the people of gabon or the people maybe in in in, in france because there's no natural resource that's why everyone is looking in a uh, uh, in congo drc so my fellow africans that's over don't forget to subscribe like comment i hope one day africa will be great and the one who will make africa great is me and you together we can thank you for watching thank you thank you very much